That doesn't look very promising. It's not very promising at all. This is what's been happening the past few days. It's bright and sunny for 10 minutes, and the rain really decides to come down in the ten. So you're running high for a little bit. And not sure if you can tell now, it's kind of blown out in the background, but the sun's out already, and looks like there's more rain on the horizon in about 10 minutes. But I wanted to tell you guys a little bit more kind of about what I'm doing on the vineyard, exactly, uh, besides replanting vines, which hopefully I finish up with tomorrow. Um, mainly, they were looking for somebody who has experience driving tractors and operating some equipment, and as you all know, I used to be a farmer, so that's pretty much right up my alley. Luckily enough, uh, I didn't have to search too hard to get the gig because, and this is no exaggeration, uh, one of my friends, friends, girlfriend's dad knows a guy. <laughs> and that's how I ended up over here on Wahiki Island. Now I'm going to be staying here doing this job until uh, probably November 30th, right there around the end of the month. At that point, I have to legally leave the country because my working holiday visa expires on the 6th of December. And after that, I'm going to be flying to Australia to see some friends. So you can see what I got going on here is how to dig up some of this clay for replanting because they have a serious rabbit problem here. And then after I get the vine in the ground, go through with some nice wet clay on top of this really, you know, soft dirt that they have here because uh, on the new vines, what happens is they get a lot of rabbit damage. So the rabbits come in, they start digging a hole because the ground's soft and they get into the plant and kill the plant off. Uh, these plants are pretty expensive. So once this wet clay hardens up and dries off, it kind of makes a little shell and they can't quite get in there. And my boss is hoping that this will stop the, the damage and they can actually get these vines up and going because they had quite a good bit of plant death over the last year or two. All right, well, I mentioned Australia earlier in this video. I mentioned I'm going to see some friends. Now, flying into Melbourne in December to meet a couple of people that I had the, the wonderful time working with in Vietnam, tour guiding, whatever you want to call it. Uh, might even end up going on a little road trip from there up to Sydney. Really think the road trip would be pretty sweet if we can make it work, because I sort of have to get to Sydney on uh, Christmas Eve, I fly back here. Also, going to Oz really helps me, because as I mentioned earlier, visa runs out here, I need to legally leave the country, kind of reset it, due to the fact that I'm coming back to New Zealand, where I'm gonna spend the holidays, Christmas and New Year's, hit a festival again with all my Kiwi kids, as I like to call them. So there you have it really a rundown. I want to show you guys my living situation. Hopefully in the next video, got a cool little caravan kind of set up. Uh, bought a motorcycle. I want to tell you about that. So we'll keep on trying to do these, hopefully weekly, maybe daily. Until then, I'm going to keep playing in the mud. See you guys. Oh.